This episode is sponsored by The Plug. You guys might have seen The Plug already on the channel in their drink form. Uh, this is The Plug in their pill form. They are the support for your liver that you need the next day. Uh, make sure you go and hit them up. Uh, check out their link in bio. You can also check them out on Instagram at The Plug. Um, thank you guys again. All right, guys, so we're back at Recovery Room, San Francisco. Today we have Crook and Marker. Thank you guys for sending us a care package. They also went ahead and sent their Espresso Martini and their Cosmo Rosa that we have already pre-mixed into cocktails, ready to go. Um, we're gonna start off with the Espresso Martini to just wake us up and get us going. Crook and Marker Espresso Martini. Cheers. Let's do this for a shot. Ten percent cocktails. That's I mean that's a that's a nice espresso martini. When you think espresso martini in a can, this is exactly what I would expect. That's it's kind of sick. Yeah, it's like a mocha. It's like chocolate. Yeah. It's like for sure chocolate. Yeah. Um, espresso martini, crook and marker. Cool. It's really good. Real good. Next up, we do have the Cosmo Rosa. Uh, also, 10% cocktail, pre mixed, ready to go. Cheers. Let's do it. Oh, this is a wow. Right off the bat, I'm getting like a gummy bear taste. Like, gummy bear, bro. Gummy right bear? Oh, this, this is incredible. Oh, this is nice. This is a very good drink to have on a like, on a nice day. Cosmo with a tequila rosa flavored twist. This is fucking oh, yeah, incredible. No, it's giving me hints of gummy bear for sure. Yeah. Oh yeah. That is fantastic. Um, mm -hmm. Set those aside now and try their mixed pack. We're gonna go ahead and pour these up. We got pina colada, we got margarita, uh, strawberry hibiscus, we got OG classic lime margarita, and lastly, we have the mojito blackberry lime. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and pour these up and try them. Cheers. Okay. They're all 5%. Um, they good flavor. Pretty good, pretty zero sugar. Yeah, next up uh, we got the strawberry hibiscus margarita. Oh, I love the color. Nice color, hell yeah. Great color. That's what you want. Cheers. Nice. Um, that was nice. I'm a fan of that. I'm a fan of that. Next one is their classic margarita. So at this point, I think I like, I'd like to say that we have somewhat of experience in it. Classic margarita. Yeah. Mm. You know what? It's very fresh lime, uh, like lime juice coming through on that one. Blackberry mojito lime. This one looks honestly. I love the can. It's got to It's got to taste good. You no, know, again, another. I love the color. Honestly, anything yeah. with like a, any drink with a nice color on it, really complicated. Really complements it. Cheers, bro. Oh yeah, the fresh mint leaf in that. That's. That's next level. Oh, that I mean, cause that like I mean that's identical to just it being muddled into, you know, a shaker. I mean that yeah. that tastes fucking good. Pina colada. We'll go ahead uh, by ranking that one first. Um, I will say that the pina colada seemed very neutral to me. Nothing crazy. Great flavor. Um, but it, it's sitting right now at like a 5.8. Super just basic flavor. Not yeah. bad. Yeah, I was gonna say the same. It's like. You don't really get a lot of coconut, a lot of pine 
pineapple. It's very subtle. It's like a it's a nice like chill drink to have. I'm gonna give it a 5.7. The strawberry hibiscus, that flavor was super fucking nice. Uh, it was very floral. Uh, the nice flavor of strawberry, but also I was like, I was really getting that hibiscus more than the strawberry. Mm -hmm. um, this guy, I'm going 6.2. Uh, I thought it was, it was excellent. Yeah. Yeah, no, honestly, what was surprised, like, looking at it, I even thought to myself, like, this may be low on my scales, but, like, it was very surprising to me. I'm gonna give this one a good, like, 6.2. It was really good, flavorful, and, like, really surprised me. Yeah. Uh, next, we have the margarita, the classic. You know, like I always say, you can never go wrong with going with a classic. Yeah. I'm going to give it, though, a good six. Again, like, just like the pina colada, I didn't get too much lime. I didn't get too much of, like, the tequila taste. It was just, like, a nice, subtle, like, flavoring. Subtle flavor. Yeah. For me, I'm probably going 5.9. Uh, it's right there. Um, but it's very, it's very just like a miss compared to other flavors. Um, there's an exotic lineup here, and that one is just very neutral. Um, it's, it's already competing with the rest, right? So, yeah. And then lastly, and then lastly, this blackberry mojito. Honestly, I'm gonna give this one a 6.5. It was, dude, that mint really like. <laughs> they nailed it with this one. Honestly. Yeah, this is like my favorite one out of all of them. For me, really quick, I'm going 6.4. Espresso martini, I'm going six. It is an espresso martini, but not. Mm -hmm. um, I would prefer it at a bar rather than in a can. Yeah, same thing. Like the mocha flavor was nice, but it just felt so like kind of bland to me. Yeah. Very watery, so it was kind of just like a mix, like feeling about it. Yeah. So I'm gonna give this one a good, like, honestly, like a five. Lastly, Cosmo Rosa. I have not tasted a canned cocktail like this before, and I've tasted a lot of canned cocktails. Uh, this guy right here, I'm going eight. That is an incredible cocktail in a can. The flavors are absolutely mind-blowing and I highly recommend out of everything we tried today this is my winner right here. That Cosmo Rosa. No, honestly no. I'm gonna give this one an eight. Like it was there dude. Like everything I, I'm like honestly everything you said is like spot on. Like this is like I honestly never experienced a drink like this. Like from the gummy bear taste like the smoothness it's not too fizzy yeah winner right here Cosmo Rosa thank you guys again Crook and Marker for sending all of these cocktails today uh, incredible product this variety right here is exceptional yeah. it is it is uh it's unique and it's authentic great flavors I've never seen the canned espresso martini already ahead with that one and the Cosmo Rosa this is the best thing Game I've yeah, had in a Game while. Changer. Thank you again the plug for keeping our livers strong for keeping us happy healthy and motivated for the next day mm -hmm. and on that note we're out. Cheers. Peace.